if you aren't using texture in your paintings, you're missing out on some really great ways to level up your artistic vision. In this video, I want to show you two of my favorite ways to use texture in landscape paintings. Texture can add so much interest. So don't miss out on this opportunity to add some of it to your own artwork. One of my most used ways to add texture is using an underpainting in one color and then add thicker paint on top. And while that top layer of paint is still drying, I am scraping back into it the thick paint to reveal the color underneath. I use different tools such as painting knives, silicone scrapers, rags. It's a wonderful way to add some subtle interest to larger areas. And depending on your tools, you can suggest anything from rock texture to grasses and um, like here, imprints of tracks into uh, some sand. Another favorite of mine is combining drawing media on top of layers of acrylic paint. I use all sorts of drawing media such as crayons, dry pastels, charcoal and graphite. Here I use charcoal on top of the acrylic painting. I apply the charcoal very quickly and boldly and then I adjust the marks afterwards using a brush and rags. Dry brush and uh, I've softened some of the marks. Um, I have a wet wipe here as well that I can uh, that I can use. I could use my hands as well, but um, I find this brush is quite uh, just a regular old household uh, brush, dry with dry bristles, works really well. Um, and I don't get my uh, my hands all uh, filled with charcoal. So I find the quick application of uh, the charcoal keeps my marks uh, fresh and exciting. And uh, you see, I'm removing almost all of them, but I can always uh, add new ones. I'd rather have one or two really great marks um, that feel exciting and uh, alive than I want a bunch of small, uh, tiny, forced uh, marks that lack energy somehow. So uh, anyway, this is a process. I'm changing my process all the time to fit my mood, to fit my style. And I think you should do the same. Uh, don't feel you have to continue doing something just because you've always been doing that. Uh, feel free to experiment. If you want to step into painting looser and making your painting routine more fun and enjoyable, don't forget to download your copy of the free guide five proven ways to loosen up your painting style. The guide has my top five tips to transform your painting style, so grab your copy of the guide via the link below this video.